Yo, what's up? It's your boy Dragon I'm back on a video, and today I'm going to be showing y'all how to make what you see on the screen. And basically, what I'm going to be showing is how to change like the icons on the social overlay template. Now, I dropped a template like a while back, I don't know how many months ago, but I dropped that a while back, and the video did pretty good. So, some people ask me how to change the icons on here, so I'm gonna just make kind of like an updated video with different icons, and I'm gonna obviously leave the template with the new icons on here. So. This is gonna be like an updated version, but I'm gonna show y'all how to change the icons. And yeah, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you wanna do is go to file, open, and you kinda just wanna pick whatever icon you want. Now I'm gonna just go to my little recycle pack or whatever and just pick some if I find some new ones. So let me just look for some and I'm gonna be back with y'all. So I'm gonna get, get Mixer, probably Discord, Facebook, I know this one. Um, I don't know, PayPal, oh, shoot. I'm just trying to find stuff. I can use, yeah, I'm gonna just use these as examples. So I'm gonna get these and get Behance SoundCloud too. I'm gonna bring in what I wanna use and simply to bring it in, you can just hit Control C, come over here, hit Control V, Control C, Control V, and I'm gonna just do this for each one I wanna use. All right, so now that you got the icons in here, it could be, a, can be a little tricky. Let me rephrase myself. But what you wanna do is simply make a group and name that group whatever you want to make so i'm gonna make a paypal group because i know i'm gonna use that then i'm gonna make another group i guess i would name this and i'm gonna just make a whole new thing for these and call it new icons so can't get these confused i'm gonna just oh shift get all these and just do that for right now new icons so i'm gonna use paypal soundcloud most definitely um and i'm gonna just do this for each icon that i want to use and i'll be back with y'all when i do that all right, so now that you got your icons, what you want to end up doing, and the ones I chose, I chose Mixer, Discord, Discord, SoundCloud, and PayPal. So I'm gonna just like name these files also, and the way I'm doing that, we just double tapping on it and then just changing the name. So double tap, and I'm gonna name this Discord. Double tap, I'm gonna name this on um, Mixer, and then double tap, I'm name this PayPal. And what you want to do now? Once you get done like renaming them, you just want to drag them to the correct group. So I'm gonna drag these in the um, right group. And yeah. So once you get that done, you want to go down here and get like the Twitter one. You want to hit Control J and we're gonna make a duplicate of this. This is what we're gonna basically base our stuff off of. We're gonna make a duplicate, spring this up here, and we're gonna kind of like hide this group a little bit. All right, so now that we got this, what you want to do on the Twitter one, you want to right click copy layer style and paste it right click paste layer style on each group basically and you just do this and now that you've done this you want to hold shift on paypal and keep holding it and go all the way up to mixture so basically go to your top one and you want to bring this down to about the size of the same size of twitter so you would do kind of, yeah kind of like that basically and you can take Twitter off to see the results. And obviously you can make it a little bit bigger, but let me see. PayPal. Yeah, so you can make it a little bit bigger, but I'm gonna find the correct size and then I'll be back with y'all. But that's basically how you wanna do it when you're dragging it down. You just wanna drag it down to the correct size. All right, so I chose about this size right here. So now what you wanna do is just go up in all these like layers and you wanna make them like the thing visible. I mean, yeah, the icon. So just go up in all of them, make them visible. Then after that, you want to go on Twitter. You want to right click and copy layer style the Twitter layer itself. And basically, what I'm gonna do is just right click, paste these layer styles on everything. Paste it on SoundCloud. Uh, paste it on Discord. All right. So now that you've done that, you should see the effect, and it might look better than the first one I did, like the one below. So just pay attention, but now that you got this, what you wanna do is, if we gonna start off with PayPal, it's gonna be like our base. We're gonna go to the Twitter text, we're gonna hit Control J on the text, bring this down and drag this into PayPal. Basically after this, we're not gonna need Twitter anymore, so we can just, you know, drag this back into where it's supposed to be at. And just put the name beside it. I'm gonna use my arrow keys to put the name beside it. And as you can see, you have name, and if you want to change the text, just change it to NF Dragon 52, I guess. But that's pretty much how you do it. So now that you got PayPal, you just want to go ahead, 
do SoundCloud the same way, drag it over, give it a little space. And you wanna hit Control J on this, drag this over. And then after, you wanna put this in the SoundCloud one. We can name this SoundCloud the text. And you should have something like this. And you just wanna drag it with your arrow key a little bit closer. And after that, uh, you wanna start on the next one. So the next one we're gonna do, gonna be Discord logo. So we'll just hold shift, drag this all the way over. Control J on the text, drag this over here. And after, drag this up above to Discord. And then gonna name this Discord text. And you basically repeat the process now. I'm not gonna put too many new social, I mean, um, icons on here. If I do, I'm just cut it out like me doing it a little bit. And skip through the video, but just hit Control J on this. Drag this up, hold Shift. And then you wanna put this on 5.5 like that. And that's basically how you change the icons. Now, I'm gonna add a little bit more icons, but it's not that hard to change them. Hopefully you understood that, but I'm gonna add some more. Just so the people that get the template, they'll have like a variety of shoes from so I'm be back with y'all when I'm done with it. So that's pretty much all I'm gonna do. Basically, to save it, what you wanna do is hit Control S, and dang, I ain't even say that I'm real tall, but to save it, just hit Control S. And I'm gonna send like the updated version in the comment section. But as you can see, I'm gonna show you like the difference: new icons, old icons. Now you might see a little difference, but hey, somebody said they wanna know how to change them. And now I'm pretty sure on these icons, I didn't have like all the effects the same as Twitter. But on this one, I do. And if you simply just want to take them off, what you would do is just come in here and take off the gradient overlay. Sometimes when you take it off, it look a little dull. But you can take off the gradient overlay and satin and just leave the other stuff on. But if you like it like this, you can personally use it like this. And to obviously change the like name, you would hit T on your keyboard to go to the horizontal type tool. Or just go over here and you can just name it and put the social you want. And just hit control s and then whenever you want to export it go to file export export as and i'm gonna just name this new socials dot 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 or something like that but i'm gonna render this and once i get done basically gonna be here with the video and yeah so i'm gonna name that and i'm gonna just put like a side by side representation control j control e touch on it. but oh it's pretty much about the same too so but yeah Pretty much how you do it. Being by dragon. If you enjoyed the video, peace out, mate.